Hello everybody, so today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about integration. So now I will show you how to answer. We have the formula in here. Let's say about tan x squared equal to secant of x squared minus 1. So I will put this one going here. This one multiplied by 1 and secant of x squared. And we got about secant of s to the power of 5 minus secant of s to the power of 3. Now I will go to first one in here. In this one, we know that we can put into secant of s square multiplied by secant of s to the power of 3. So I need to use about integration bypass. So I will put about u equals to secant of s to the power of 3. If I do first the derivative for the both sides, we have the u equal to 3 secant of s to the power of 3 times s ds. First, the derivative of this one in here, you got about number 3, and we have secant of s squared. But first, the derivative of secant of s, you got about secant of s times s, that's why you got about secant of s to the power of 3, that's it from number 2 plus number 1. And we have tan s dv, we have secant of s squared ds, the integration of this one. We have v equal to tan s. So we have u multiplied by v. That's about secant of s to the power of 3 multiplied by tan s minus the u multiplied by v. So we have number 3 in here. And we have the integration secant of s to the power over of 3. And we have tan s squared the s tan s square that's e about secant of s square minus 1 now we need to expand this one we have negative number 3 secant of s to the power of 3 multiplied by secant of s square we have negative number 3 the integral of secant of s to the power of 5 ds plus negative number 3 plus uh, negative number 3 with negative number 1 you got about plus in here and we have number 3 and we have the integration secant of s to the power of 3 ds now if we look carefully about this one they will repeat about the integration of secant of s to the power of 5 ds and now I will put this one like this next I will put this one go to the right and we have 3 the integration of secant of s to the power of 5 ds plus about this one in here now 3 plus 1 you got about number 4 later that we divide both sides by number 4 And we have this integration in here. Now we go back to this one. So we have the integration of secant of s to the power of 5. So we have this one in here. And we have the negative. The integration of this one in here. 
Now, 3 over 4 minus number 1, we have negative 1 over 4. Now, I will concentrate about this one only. So this one we can write into secant of x, secant of x and secant of x squared. So we need to use about integration by pass. So I need to put about u equals to secant of x. If we do first the derivative we have the u equals to secant of s tan s ds dv we have secant of s where ds the integration of this one we have v equals to tan s so we have u multiplied by v minus the u multiplied by v so we have the integration secant of s tan s square the s about this one we can put about secant of s square minus one so we have this one with this one and we have negative secant of s to the power of three Negative with negative, you got about positive. And we know that everything in here equals to this one. Now, the next step, we put this one go to the right. So we have two integrals, we sum together, and we have number two. Later that, we divide both sides by number two. Next, the integration of this one, we have ln of the absolute value of secant of s plus tan s and we will about c in here now let's go back to this one this integration that's about this one in here and we put about c and then negative 1 over 4 multiplied by 1 over 2, 1 over 2. So we have a final answer. That's about 1 over a secant of s tan s minus 1 over 8 ln of the absolute value of secant of s plus tan s. This is the end. Thank you for watching.